What's up guys, this is Karax and we're doing another Pokemon Scarlet Shiny Hunt. I'm pretty excited about this. We're going to do Fluttermane this time. I already have one, but I want to mark one like we got the Dawn Fan last, or the, excuse me, the Great Task last time. It's going to be so exciting. Alright, so in order to do this, we got to make another sandwich. And you know the rules about sandwiches, you got to make a good sandwich. I'm looking at a specific streamer right now. You see me? Mm -hmm. You got to make a good sandwich, okay? Anyways, so, since we are doing fairy type, let me get over to the table. Oh my goodness. I don't know how to play anymore. We're going to make a sandwich. Alright, here we go. This is by far the best thing we've ever done. So, in this we're going to need tomatoes, onions, green bell peppers, a hamburger, and two more tomatoes. And <clears throat> for this one, you can use any Urban Mysticas you, you want. You need to have two. Doesn't matter what else. You just need to make sure you have two Urban Mysticas. Boom and boom. There we go. Get our red flag pick. All right, we're gonna put our dressings on there. And now we're gonna start making our delicious sandwich. We got lots of tomatoes, so we're probably gonna wanna put these on the bottom. So we got it there there oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah look at that doesn't that look beautiful all right all right all right more tomato this is a very tomato-y sandwich oh yeah oh yeah oh yeah look at it look at it it's beautiful you're gonna get all this nice tomatoiness this is such a good tomato sandwich tomatoes when i was a kid i didn't like them all that much but now that i've gotten older I enjoy them and we want to spread the onions out because if you have too much onion in one place it's gonna mess with the taste and we got green bell peppers put some right there right there and right there now we can't really like put the hamburger anywhere that we want it to because if we were doing this in real life we would want to cut the hamburger in half but since I cannot cut the hamburger in half to spread it out across evenly across the bun, we're gonna throw it right in the middle. Cause the, there we go. Ah yes. Uh oh. What happened to my sandwich? All right, we're just gonna throw the pick in there, and that is gonna be okay. That's a little embarrassing. Right after I said that to that specific streamer. So, <laughs> anywho. We're going to go ahead and get our fairy stuff from this tomato -y goodness. And you could say it's a pizza with um, not liquidy sauce. That's what it is. Ooh, it's spicy. Mm. Ah, yes. I love spicy food. Like, literally, I eat spicy food all the time. I can eat, I like raw jalapenos. I pr pretty much put, like, spicy stuff in everything. I don't know why, but this is me. I love spicy stuff. And, uh... Anywho, we are going to go to the place where Fluttermane spawns. It is level 3, it's in the cave, it's with Roaring Moon. Um, and we did Fairy because, like, there are other ghosts that spawn there, and I don't really want to run into a graveyard or its pre evolution. You know, we're going to run into it anyway. I'm not looking for that. I'm looking for a marked Fluttermane. We didn't save it before we ate. I think I saved it before I started recording. Anyways, well, if we don't run into something, I'm going to have to reset. <clears throat> Got some uh, screaming tails, some flabby bites, and we're just going to sprint on over to the cave. Alrighty, so here we are. Got some chancy. So basically, we're just going to do what we did last time with Great Tusk, and we're just going to walk around, and we're going to hopefully run into a flutter main here pretty soon if i need to quick cut again i will it's not a big deal to me i'm not seeing any flutter mains that's kind of sad but we're just gonna keep on walking oh, see that's exactly why we didn't do ghost hmm where are you flutter main flutter into my heart actually it already did it's a beautiful pokemon beautiful pokemon <clears throat> I should not have eaten before I started to record. Are we going to get a Fluttermane to spawn? 
Hmm? Um, I've seen this happen occasionally where it doesn't spawn. I might need to reset. Um, and then just do a quick cut. Yeah, the fact that we're not seeing any. And I'm supposed to have encounter level 3. Very alarming. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and do a quick cut. I'm just going to go reset it and then we're going to be back. I'll be right back. All right, we're back and I got the sandwich to look perfect. It is a perfect sandwich. See, that's how a good sandwich looks. Not like my monstrosity earlier. That's good. All right, so we're gonna get our fairy power. I'm gonna go to the area and hopefully, hopefully they spawn this time. If they don't, I'm gonna be really irritated. Of course my sandwiches are three stars. I make the most bomb sandwiches ever. And I can make real good sandwiches in real life too. Not, not, don't want to toot my own horn. Don't want to toot my own horn. But I make pretty good sandwiches. Alright, going back down. this game I don't want I, I, I know some people have like some issues with it but like I really like this game like I have not enjoyed a Pokemon game this much since X and Y I thoroughly enjoyed X and Y I thought it was a wonderful game Mega Evolution is by far my favorite gimmick that they have done um, I wish they would have brought it back but they didn't uh, I'm okay with terrestrializing I think oh, what in the <laughs> what is Okay, so I did buy Ultra Balls. <laughs> Let's just go ahead and throw one. Maybe we can get super duper lucky. Alright. Quick catch. Okay, so we're going to do this again. <clears throat> you know, I I'm feeling it. I'm, fe I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. I'm really feeling it. Quick catch. Nope. Nope. Okay. Alright. Uh, that's going to hurt a bit. Oh, great task, you are not very... What can I use this? I can flame charge it. And they start bringing like weaker Pokemon. No, it has terrible physical defense. This is, this is silly of me. I didn't think about this. And it has power gym. This isn't going to work out very well. Just chunk a ball. Get caught, Fluttermane. There you go. That's how you catch things. <laughs> All right, so we are gonna go ahead and look and see if this if this one has a mark and it was the very first one I saw. We're gonna. I, I'm literally just gonna fall out of my chair. Get back on screen. Oh, that's <laughs> oh man, the luck. First one is a shiny, and it has a oh man. Let's into the box. Let's go ahead and go peek at it. I know we're wasting time, but it's whatever. I don't care. This go ahead and move you to the party uh, over here. What is it? What is it? What is it? Peeved. <laughs> He's grumpy. He's like me. <laughs> oh, I'm me the grumpy. That's awesome. That's so cool. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Uh, let me put this back in my box so we don't... 
accidentally put any EVs on it because I am going to want to EV train this and use it. Alright, where are you going? Where are you? Oh, I got this, uh, this uh, tad bulb. Belly Bolt is like by far one of my favorite um, new Pokemon. Alrighty, so let it, let's continue on to this adventure of uh, Flutter Rains. We're going to see how many we can get. Um, we're starting off really strong. Uh, so, anyways, we're going to go ahead and do a quick cut until I see my next one. If I see my next one, if I don't, then we'll just uh, probably about the last five minutes of the power, I will jump back in and we'll do a little. We'll do a little recap and talk just like I did with the Great Tusk one. All right, I'll see you in a bit. All right, everyone, it looks like all of the Flutter mains have uh, <laughs> fluttered away. So what we're going to do is we're going to use the last 20 minutes of our time. We're going to look at all these screaming, roaring tails, screaming tails. Um, maybe we'll get a shiny one of these. I only have one, so it'd be pretty dope to get one. Or maybe we'll run into a shiny Flabebe, but I'm, I'm telling you right now, I'm not going to walk up to every single Flabebe and look at it. Because it, it, it's got, or those flow hats, whatever. Whatever, that, that stupid fairy thing. Maybe, maybe, maybe. Maybe there are screaming tails in this cave. I can't remember. I'm pretty, I don't remember where, what I was doing when I got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're looking for red eyes. Instead of the yellow eyes. These ones are a little bit harder to spot than Fluttermane or Great Tusk. But you can still see them pretty easily. You just gotta look at their eyes. They're not Medusa, they're not going to turn you into stone, so yes. Look at their eyes. Although I would not use this thing competitively. It's like super fast and super bulky. Like, it, it stats to me don't really make sense. But, uh, if, I mean, whatever floats your boat. If you want a really fast, like, toxic user, I, I guess. Whew. How is everyone doing tonight? I'm having a pretty fantabulous day. I worked, work was kind of hectic, but that's okay. My friend, I went and I saw my friend during work because they, she works close to me. So that was a good time. It's always good to see friends. All right, so. We're going to do a little quick cut until we see a shiny, um, a shiny one, and I'll see y'all over there. Alright, I'm just checking in. I'm still no shiny. we got about 10 minutes left. So I just wanted to, I don't know, talk. I got tired of sitting here in silence, just staring at my screen. All these yellow eyes are kind of creeping me out, man. <laughs> They're scary. I just need one of you to have a red pair of eyes. So, we're gonna, hopefully it's not that one in the wall. That would be very sad. So, anywho, we are gonna go back to sitting in silence. So, like I said, I'll be with y'all in about five minutes left or if we hit a shiny. But anyways, I will talk to y'all in a bit. All right, everyone, we have about six minutes left. Um, so I'm just going to talk the rest of the time so there's actually, like, somewhat of a video. Uh, this, like, started out as the most exciting thing ever. First encounter, shiny, marked, wonderful, and now it's just going to turn into nothing. Like, none of these screaming tails want to have red eyes. I know you. I know you got drops for the red eyes, like the clear eyes, whatever it is. Um, yeah, so we're we're still searching for some red eyes. Low key, these yellow beads are very like soul seeking, soul devouring. I don't know. They like they creep me out, man. I don't like it. Creep. It's like they're just staring at your soul. I'm like. Ugh. Yeah, I hope I, I hope I hope you're having a great day too. Not a decent day. Um, 
that's fun. I enjoyed it. Got to spend some time with my child, and that's always the best thing ever. Well, that is... I kind of just talk out by myself. It's what I normally do. Shiny hunting. Making videos. Dreading going to work the next day. <laughs> I don't dread it that much. I actually enjoy my job most days. That past week has been a little hectic, but like most days it's been it's pretty good. I do I do enjoy my job. You know what I enjoy, I would enjoy more though? Uh, a red eyed screaming tail. I would enjoy that a lot more. But, anywho, but th 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 that just goes to show you that shiny hunting, it's never a guarantee. I know, like, it's a lot easier than it used to be. And, you know, I probably would have run into more than one if I had the shiny charm, but I am way too lazy to do that. And plus, I feel like having lower odds of seeing a shiny makes it a little bit more exciting. Maybe more fun to watch too. I don't know. Like shinies in general are just exciting. Um, yeah. So this is a uh, the screaming tail. We're still going, looking for that red-eyed one. I uh, I never. I still haven't posted that Superior V Star um, video. I probably need to do that because I recorded it right after I did the Great Test recording. I just haven't had time to go and record, uh, edit it and, you know, post it. I, I do think it was a pretty easy video to record, because the games went pretty long, but, you know, it's neither here nor there. It'll get posted eventually. Uh, yeah. But, uh, don't, don't forget... Wait, wait, wait. Oh, no. Nope. Don't forget, please like and subscribe to the video. I know a lot of people who are not subscribed. Actually, a lot of people are not subscribed. The 97% of the people who have watched my video, my videos recently, are not subscribed. So please just click that subscribe button. I would love to have something to show for all these videos that I'm making. And for the 30 of you that are subscribed, thank you. Thank you so much. Like, that's really cool that you did that, you clicked that button, that subscribe button. Oh my goodness, Screaming Tail, where are you? Well, I mean, I, I guess they're kind of everywhere, but Red-Eyed Scream Tail, Red-Eyed Scream Dragon. I have a problem with jumping in games. It's a bad habit. I used to play World of Warcraft a lot, and uh, I, I played Death Knight, who doesn't really like need to move, or can move a lot um, when you're using their their attacks. Like I, I played Frost uh, Death Knight, and like <laughs> I would just hit the space bar, and then uh, my, uh, my friends that I played would be like, Dang it, Michael! Stop jumping! I can't click on the monster, I'm like, just hit tab. But it's okay. Fun times. WoW was definitely really fun back then. Only got less than a minute. So, yeah, I've seen weirder things. I think we hit the other Great Tusk like pretty close to the end last time. So, who knows? We could see it. We could see it. You never know till, uh, until the timer ends. I swear if it's that one on the wall, I'm going to be upset. I don't think it was, because the tail is a little bit of a different color, and it looked the same. That one looked the same, that one looked the same. Well, it, it does appear as though we are going to have a single shiny hunt. Which is okay. That was still exciting with the Fluttermane Eye. That was, that literally, that was insane. So... I'm glad I got to share that with all of you. 
when the other mon starts spawning all up. There we go. And that is it. Got ourselves some other mons spawning. So that will be all she wrote. So anyways, we only got one. It's a pretty cool one though. Like we're going to go back and look. Can I learn how to do stuff? Go back and look at this Fluttermane. Check summary. A grumpy Pokemon. So awesome. So cool. Very first one we saw. So anyways, um, I'm going to continue doing these shiny hunts. I enjoy doing it. I hope y'all enjoy doing it. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. And if y'all want me to shiny hunt anything specific, I'm more than happy to do it. Just let me know which mod you want me to go for. And if you want me to do like full odds or sandwich method, I'll probably do the sandwich method because I do not have patience for full odds. But anyways... Let me know what y'all want me to do. Um, if not, we'll continue going through all of the Paradox forms in Scarlet. And I don't know, we could probably do group on it next. That'd be kind of fun. That thing looks interesting. Look at that. Freaking caveman Amoongus over there. <laughs> but anyways, I hope y'all have... Sincerely, I hope y'all are having a great day or a great night or a great thing. Anyways, I'll see y'all next time.